like the icing on the top of the cake for me. Because I had watched them with the first needle, like, digging all around. It was uh. They were, like, digging all around there trying to get blood. And it didn't work. And that had already got me a little <laughs> freaked out. Well, don't watch that. Normally, that doesn't bother me. But then with you fainting and I'm all, like, you're, like your eyes are fluttering and you know, all this stuff. And then she's, like, she's not recovering. You know, her blood pressure, her pulse rate's only 40. That did it. And then I'm like, oh man, I think I'm gonna faint. I have to sit down. So I had to leave her side and go sit in the chair. And then so I start <laughs> feeling better. And then she's like sitting in the chair. And then I start laughing at her because she was like dying. And then, then her doctor comes in to like, because I called her doctor over the thing. And then, uh, so she's starting to get better. She's laughing. I'm laughing at I'm her. I'm starting to feel better. So I'm laughing. So then I'm like, I said to her doctor, I'm like, see? Now you know why we both need anxiety medication. So then she started laughing. <sighs> but yeah. So, basically... I want it to be good because normally I'm not good. Actually, this is the first time in her 19 years that we have ever gotten her blood drawn at the doctor for a physical and she has not cried. I think it's the anxiety medication. And when I say not cried, when Kylie would cry, <laughs> screaming. It's like, screaming! It's like, actually, it sounds like hysteria. I'm getting tortured. Hysteria. <laughs> but yeah, so like I was like so calm. But like I want it to be good because. She has to bribe me to be good. <laughs> Even though I'm 19. I was like, okay, I got caught. She made me come in with her for the physical. Yeah. So anyway. <laughs> um, just because I'm an only child. I'm the baby. So, I got contacted by this glasses company. And they're like, hey, can we send you free glasses to try out? And I was like, okay. But I need my prescription. So I would need to call my eyeglasses place. And I was like, if I'm good, will you call for me? And mom was like, sure. So, <laughs> you're calling. So now after all that traumatizing experience. And didn't you say I was like all sweaty? Yeah, the, yeah, you were all sweaty. The back of your shirt's all, you can like see your sweatiness oh, on the back of your gross. shirt. Oh, gross. Yeah, it is the gross <laughs> But yeah, so that's what I did today. But, like, okay. Here's how you can tell how much the anxiety medication is working. Apparently, <clears throat> tell them what I would do the day of. A oh my morning. gosh. In the fall, this past fall, <clears throat> when she had to go to her doctor's appointment to see our doctor, who's this really nice lady, just to tell her about her anxiety and ask for anxiety medication. She wasn't even getting a physical. She was not getting her blood drawn. Just going to the doctor and talking to her. I came home from work. She was literally in the fetal position in bed and been laying there for hours. <laughs> all worked up over going to the doctor. So anxious I was And be. then while we were waiting for the doctor her teeth were chattering from nerves. I don't know if any of you have ever been nervous enough that you're that your teeth chatter from nerves. Her teeth w chattered from nerves. She was so anxious. So, yes, this is, I mean, even though she fainted, <laughs> I she mean, was calm. She's like, can't laughing. control that. She's got, we have a picture of her and the, like. Yeah, if you follow me on Snapchat, you would have seen I posted about going to the doctor. And she, like, when she had to put the, the gown oh on, gosh, the ga there you could fit like four Kylie's <laughs> in this gown. But yeah. So, yeah, she was like laughing. And, you know, she was nervous, but at Who's least not she was, nervous? like, functioning like a normal person. Yeah, before I'd, like, before she be painted. completely <laughs> silent, like, <laughs> freaking out. Like, I was, like, it looked like I was, like, traumatized. You know, I wonder if she didn't uh, have a problem with the first arm, if you would have been all right. Who knows? It might have been the trauma of, like, oh, no, now I have to do this again. Yeah. Faints. <laughs> Did you show them your cranberry juice? Oh yeah, they, they even gave you one for the ride home. I drank this one, <laughs> and then 
I got a second one, which is actually good because I get kidney stones, and cranberry juice is good for kidney stones, so that's actually good. Good for fainting, good for kidney stones. <laughs> well, we're home now, so bye! Yeah. <laughs>